All right, we're back. Okay. Hurry up. You're wasting time. All right, um, so what's important? The basement. Open the door. Oh. This is not how you're spending your time. <laughs> <laughs> 69 420 I was I want to explore in there but that's probably where he comes from all right hey douchebag Gary 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 hey Gary Gary you're gonna get stabbed first dude Gary Gary stop you die in this hallway I saw it I saw it you die up here stop it stop it Stop it. No, no. Like, she has nothing important to say to you. Oh, Frankenstein. Oh, Frankenstein. All 816 pages of it. Heard it's a great book. <laughs> Jason, why do you have, like, 120 hours in, uh, <laughs> in Homebody? Well, I read Dracula, and then I read Frankenstein. <laughs> What just happened? What the fuck is happening? That's an overreaction. Yeah. Good to see you too, Francine. Oh, interesting. It seems like in her mind she's remembering the fact that she died and stuff is happening, but her responses are like normal, like overreaction in the head and you're trying to just keep it together. Yeah, did... Uh, did did we imagine that? Yeah, see? Like, it doesn't matter which answer I pick, like, something else is coming through. What the hell? Yeah, it's like you're having a panic, panic attack about something in your head, but you're just communicating normally. <laughs> yep, it's like we're playing, a, like, uh, the subconscious. Yep. Wow, okay. Alright, thanks. This is uh, a whole different vibe now. Yep. <laughs> it's it's nothing. If you say so. Don't call me buddy. <laughs> yeah, that's your buddy guy. Okay. <laughs> just pick, yeah, just, just saying whatever you want. We can't, okay. Oh, interesting. things that's how people died <laughs> yeah I think I have until midnight no <laughs> it was like uh, by 11 o'clock that you had corpses alright um, I'm gonna spend like 10 minutes on this Easily a half hour, 45 minutes. 
It may be 45 minutes. Because <laughs> it's already been 10. <laughs> <gasps> I got it. First try, baby. How the hell did this even happen? Who cares? Can we arranged in any order. Okay. Long time, long time. All right, so that one's good. Apparently. Uh oh. Okay, power. <laughs> Did it? Is the door open yet? Are you guys still alive? She oh, she's playing Mario. Oh, she is. <laughs> hey, Megan, what you up to? I'm so glad you're here. I've had a crush on you forever. myself the hardest. Oh, thank God for Pete. I'm touring because I, I really want to watch like bird mystery on the TV. <laughs> I think it's going to be back soon. At least the time gets paused when you're talking to somebody. Right. So the yellow cable goes to the door, right? Yeah. And the teal cable comes from upstairs. Ah. Gary. Gary. You already talked to Gary. Stop talking to Gary. I'll talk to Gary down here. Lie, it was good. <laughs> yep. Jesus, that sounds horrible. Yeah. Oh man, so excited. I feel like I drank a ton of coffee. I'm still upset that you didn't really like my idea. What idea? Where we buy coffee and get a coffee pot and fill the place where you put water with Red Bull. No. Oh, with Monster. Sorry, it was with Monster. I automatically hate any idea that involves Monster energy, energy drink. I'll settle for Red Bull. I think there's more caffeine in that anyway. And then we could put a little pre-workout in it. Really just like up the ante on how long we need to be awake. <gasps> no! We'll take We'll get, like, a quart of five-hour energy. I've never hated a sentence more. <laughs> the fact that you use quart, quart, and five-hour energy. Yeah. Well, a gallon would take a really long time, because they only come in those little shots. So. I know, but 
still. We can go to Costco. We get four cases of five hour energy, which would be like. Why couldn't it have been a cup? No, dude. No, because we need to make a pot of coffee. No, we don't. Several pots of coffee. No, we don't. Yeah. He's gonna wake Jesus. up. Jesus. Just rip that fucking door off the hinges, <laughs> yeah, why don't you? Like, just blow that door right off the hinges. Um, I kind of wish I hadn't made it. Well, the one guy is like 33 hours late. I bet he's a killer. No way. Too convenient. Truth is, he was killed on the road. Don't worry, I fixed it. Yeah, I fixed it. I guarantee you we have not been in this room before because the first thing I did was avoid this room. <laughs> yeah, which is why everybody died. Yeah. Um, are you dehydrated? Is your blood sugar low? Do you need a snack? Are you full? Are you sleepy? Is it everything but the fact that we are all going to die by knife point here shortly? <laughs> you Do you need to poop? <laughs> Do you need to poop? <laughs> Are you constipated? Are you like, do you have diarrhea? These are all very separate. This game does say, oh. ah! Oh, the power's out. Is it? Yeah. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Okay. No. Flip. Flip. Hey. Oh, hey. Who are you again? Wow. Like, Hey, uh, murderer, can you come to the kitchen? Cliff's in the kitchen. Cliff's in the kitchen. Oh, and it's open. Is that the fucking losers? Seems stretched to in. It will make me hyperventilate. Uh, uh, well, now that I got my to do list, <laughs> match. What are you doing? Uh, the wrong thing, apparently. I wish she got stabbed. <laughs> uh, that's a weird thing to hope. A sea urchin? No, that looks like a cell. Or a virus. Yeah. But she's also right, it does look like a nautical mine, too. Yep. Or a sea urchin. Reinforced ones are five apiece. What does rotating them accomplish? I don't know. I don't well, they, they go in order, so. Is it supposed to be 12? No, we don't know about this one at all. Oh, yeah, because the one upstairs. Yeah, the one you did was supposed to be 12. All the, all the way up the wall. Okay. There's a hole in the wall. Check the machine. The fuck is that supposed to mean? 
I have no idea. I mean, I have to. Okay, I did my best. Maybe it's controlled by a near die device. Is it this device? You know what it is. You know what about like unlocks the killer. Huh. It'd be, it's not. It's not something I bet, but um, it'd be funny um, when you got the <laughs> when you've screwed up at Minesweeper. Oh, it's like now nah, I'm gonna kill you. Yeah, you screwed up at Minesweeper, and that unlocked the door. Okay. Need the black. No. There might be something needed in here. Like a code. Well, you're just gonna sit there and flip at it. <laughs> Either read it or don't. I did. Okay. I got the thing that I needed off of it. What was the thing you needed? 1979. Okay. Just like how there's a code upstairs of 1913. Check the locker. Do do. I don't know. Let's go find the lights are on. No, they're not. Is this on? No. Press button. No. God, it's a lot to tell you that it's not working. And I have to watch it again. <laughs> oh. It uh, gave a different dialogue than it did before. Oh, you guys oh, are still people alive. are actually alive. Okay, you have something to add, Cliff? Oh, you know who I am now. Yep, that's about the extent of the conversation I expected you two to have. It's barely even on fire. The transformer is barely even on fire. It's like, why would the power be out? That's a good question. Well, but they probably got some to hide. Yep. What? <laughs> Didn't you walk in the door like a minute ago? Should I be taking your keys? What the fuck is that awful sound? <laughs> you gotta get out of here. That's what I'm trying, but you are the least helpful person in this house. Yeah. And that's like a tall statement because I'm not doing anything to help you guys. <laughs> Nobody's doing anything to help this situation. You all suck. Yeah. Everybody sucks. You are way. going to die again and again. Can you reverse all the lights on that panel? Oh, light up everything except for? Yeah, just... Rats. The pop is leaking. I think somebody died. Because I hear lots of ruckus upstairs. You really? Yeah. I know the sound of ruckus when I hear it. Da ah, da. <laughs> See, told you, ruckus. Well, they were my friends, and were they're they? gone now. Well, Megan was a friend. Was she? Yeah. She's the one I liked the most because she was playing Mario like a second ago. Yeah, and she was glad to see you. Not like Cliff saying he didn't want to talk to you at all.
And like, he also forgot what my name was. Dude, this is hard. Like, how are you supposed to do anything? Right. I think like the purpose of this is supposed to keep dying. Keep dying and start asking the right question. You gotta start finding the right information. Maybe. Apparently your superpower is like death checkpoint. Ugh, Groundhog Day. <laughs> superpower. Or ReZero for anime fans. Yep. You be quiet. Like, the reason why he's hovering in here is because he can hear you whimpering. wonder if there's a button to hold your breath, but it would probably tell you on the screen if there were. Yeah. Front door. You win. You won. Like, why was that a core memory? I don't know. Mine note. <gasps> the mine and minesweeper. Is that the same as... Where is it? Uh, six? The same as this? No, it's only four. Yeah, I get it. That's the... Okay, I guess I can go play Minesweeper again. See if that does anything. So this led to this. Yep. A post it on the wall there? No, you can't read it. Yeah. Shit. Skip. Never mind. <laughs> Stab. Womp womp. Womp womp. Okay. I want to touch your tires. <laughs> this thing been following Spooky. her? Great. Huh? What? You're the one with the sense of being better than the things you're better than. I understand where you come from. I've been there. What? Immediately get back to you in your car and drive away from this man. <laughs> yep. I am there. Uh. She doesn't look like she could fight her way out of a paper bag, so should I just say what? Well, who the hell are you? No, who the hell are you implies that I care who he is. Yeah. What are you babbling about? <laughs> also, what implies I want to know more. <laughs> Can I help you? Why yeah. are you saying things that I'm not saying? <laughs> yep. I'm trying very hard to leave there. I don't know where you are because the only sentence you've said to me has given me no indication of what it meant to be a person weren't you listening he said where he was he said he's at that place where you think you're better than the things you're better than <laughs> riveting <laughs> yeah which is like right next to cuckoo town yep you're probably expecting a reward but winning only gets you in deeper get in your car please <laughs> get in your fucking car Are you trying to find a way to keep your elbows clean? <laughs> I see your left arm raise. I'm curious about the state of your right eye. <laughs> it's such a wild, like, 
This is something I would expect out of the cabin in the woods, like when they stop at the gas station and they're just like, Oh, I see your right elbow's dirty. And that, you know what that means? It means your left eye needs to be rinsed out with gasoline. It's like, fucking what, dude? I have gasoline. <laughs> Uh, I'm just trying to gas up my car, dude. Like, that that's thats the appropriate response for us. It's like, bro, I'm just trying to get some gas. Like, I'm not trying to have this, like, philosophical conversation with you. This is not a conversation. This is, I mean, like, to this him, is, this is a conversation. This is hostage taking. <laughs> yeah, this is verbal hostage. Yeah. Who do you Who show, show your dick to? to? <laughs> Are you, Are you going, going to, to the, the train, train station? Oh, I thought you said train town. I was like, ew. Are you going to the train town? <laughs> Rubble aside the train town? <laughs> Are you going beneath the train town? <laughs> Have a good night. I like how the color scheme changes and it's just like his face darkens. I'll see you at the train town. <laughs> I'm already there. I'm already there that you're not there when you were there. Fucking shit. <laughs> what the hell? All right. So do I need to... No, because it's already solved. Okay. So... Okay. Solve more puzzles. Move more forward. Talk to more people. Get more info. Hey. Have you spoken to the man about the train? Town? <laughs> Yeah. What's up? Alright, I may be in hell, but at least I can talk to my friends. I want to cry and look at them. Blah, blah, blah. I want to cry when I look at them, but I guess I'll just talk about the weather or whatever. It's nothing. Yeah, how about that? It was kind of shitty when I said hi. I think that's what I have to do is I have to find the right combination of, like, conversation. Yep. Because she says the things... Because, like... Every, every once in a while, like, one of the options, she actually says it. Yeah. Like... Uh, it's one of those uh, tropes in, in movies that I don't like. Because, like, if I found myself in this situation where, like, I kept dying and all my friends kept dying, but I keep get it, getting reset. Like, in the movies, like, they come back and they talk, like, all nonsense and they sound crazy. Mm -hmm. I'd be like... No, I can't do that. It just freaks everybody out. Everybody will think you're crazy. I have to find a way to, like, do this another way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Without just sounding like a lunatic. <laughs> For all his bluster, Cliff usually is more of a passive-aggressive kind of guy. I mean, he's uh -huh. kind of... I, that seemed aggressive aggressive <laughs> it seems very pat no what he's doing seems very passive aggressive like when you say hi to somebody you just like flick your cigarette and like leave passive aggressive <laughs> uh that's such a riveting thing to do though it's so much fun i've done it with like toothpicks and stuff like that where it's like all right we're gonna go back inside and you're just like Blink. and you just like bunk walk, walk back into somewhere Even when I brought you up. Uh, these are all viable, actually. Moving away. Think so? Yeah. Yeah. Too good. There though. you go. Yeah. Yikes. Da. Microphone. Why do you gotta eat the microphone? No, it was at a respectable distance. Why? It's, still, it's leaning do at you... me. <laughs> it's leaning at me. I don't know what you want. I know. Cause you set it up that way, like it didn't do it to you. There. 
Uh, what do we think? Inanimate object one, Tim zero. Yeah, that's usually how it goes. Um, so you really missed him, but I didn't. You two are super close, then, right? I don't care. <laughs> um, remember about the dialogue where we're trying to not sound like a lunatic? Right, I really missed him. All right, cool. Seems we're doing better. We can think I made things worse. Probably just acting out. Bring it up to him. You know, both know he won't react well if I actually talk to him about it. Uh, there you go. Okay. Gary's on it. Oh, good old Gary. Wish we could just talk to him regular style, you think? Uh, that's what I'm thinking. There we go. Because that's, that's how I feel. I'm like, yeah. God, I wish we could just talk like adults. <laughs> yeah, in a way. <laughs> Instead of just being mad at somebody. Here, we haven't really caught up in a while. I'm still noodling around as an illustrator. Megan and Cliff and Bunge. Oh, is he still working on comics? Man, we are like six for six. Nice. If a zine is sloppy, what's a zine? A uh, design. I think that's slang. For oh the my mess. god, are you serious? Yeah, pretty sure. I'm gonna look it up. I hate like I want to confirm that I'm hating that for okay. the right reason. Because if that's what it is, I hate it. Oh, I think it's pronounced zine. As in short for magazine. I still kind of uh, hate it. A zine is a small circulation, self-published work of original or appropriated text and images. Oh, so it's an actual thing. Yeah. Okay. And it's got its own wiki page. It came right up. I didn't expect that, actually. Okay. Oh, candy shops. I had a coworker talk to me about the, uh, they had just gone to the co the candy shop in Jordan, you know, mm -hmm. like biggest candy shop in the world. Yeah. I want to go. All the shit you can't get anywhere else, like Purple Crush. When was the last time you saw Purple Crush? Never. I don't know if I've ever seen Purple Crush. Exactly. <laughs> And she's like, yeah, they had Crush in a teal can. I was like, what the fuck is a teal can Crush? Oh, Tropical Punch. Had no idea it was a thing. Ever, probably, maybe it never was. Oh, please give me something I can use, Gary. I think the I think these have to happen though. I think in order to save your friends, you have to, like, repair your relationship with them. Only to find out that all this shit is in my head. I don't know. I don't either. Um. 
Okay. Oh, that's so weird. Huh. Because that was his line. That was his line in the other playthrough. He's like, oh yeah, this place has a Texas chainsaw, like hills have eyes kind of vibe. And you just said it back to him and he didn't agree with you. You didn't agree with the Texas chainsaw. Like it was like, oh, it was more austere than Texas chainsaw. Huh. Looking around for a hidden passage where there's at least a dumb waiter to hide. Does this in. house even have a dumb waiter? He said he's looking for it. What kind of question is that? Yeah. Oh, you use the middle line because that's one I would talk about. Because like, my grandparents' house did have a laundry chute. And we did do that. Yeah. Just toss stuff down. I always wanted something like that. Have you seen the, the new houses that have um, their suction? They're, uh, yeah, they have like airflow in it, like almost like a light vacuum. So you can fling your shirt at the wall and it'll suck it into this tube and spit it out in your laundry room. No way. Yeah, it's so awesome. <laughs> I'm like, I want that in my house so bad. It's just like, and it just, yep. I imagine problems. Yeah, probably. But like, yeah, in the one video that I saw, like this lady ran through her room and she grabbed like a pair of jeans, a t-shirt, a couple pairs of socks, and she was just like flinging them out the wall. And they were just like, <laughs> I was like, this is so cool. I think this comment from Gary is a little on the nose. Fake out mass killer prank. Now we just need our wacky friend who never takes anything serious to do a fake out mass killer prank, you know, as a misdirect. Would that be have been Pete? And who never takes anything serious to do a fake out. Um. That's the thing. Is he being sarcastic? Because if he's being sarcastic, it's me. Unless he's referring to himself and like the. Halfway. I don't think he's referring to himself. So then it should be Pete then, right? Uh, we don't know anything about Pete, so that's what I would guess. <laughs> huh. Emily, you don't need to stand here talking to me. That's a weird way to abruptly end the conversation. Alright, so you can only talk to somebody for so long, now that we know that. Yeah, we got through all the dialogue options. Oh, that's that. Is Is that got a question mark? Is it literally a question mark? Oh, it is a question mark. Kind of. As in, what the fuck is this? (laughs) What is it? Three, three, four, two? Four, four, two? Looks like it's a six by six. No, three up, three to the right, four up, four to the left. The entire platform is a six by six tip. No, the lights. What are you talking about? Three lights. lights going north, three lights going east, three four lights going north again. In terms yeah, of like I, I know what you're saying, that's the green path, but I'm saying the whole thing, the whole panel is six cubes by six cubes. No, I know. Okay. Um, I'm saying I'm wondering if they're lit up because it's trying to tell me a number combination. Okay, so you can only talk to somebody for so long. That means that that tells me that there ha- like the conversation itself has to be impactful in some way. Because then they just abruptly end the conversation. 106. I tried. (laughs) 
Oh, now do you have nothing in there? Yeah, there's nothing in here now. It's empty. We're in a simulation. You've been matrixed. Pretty much. So the program is failing. Okay, so what'd she say? Oh, I packed in a panic. There's two or two pairs of pants and no underwear. Yeah. Okay. But the her room is at the end of the hall. Yep. Which would be Nope. The one we can't open. I guess there's a power box in the living room upstairs. Just brute force in this. Hmm. I'm like so close and you know it. Is the computer broken? Yes. Well, that's strange. Seems deliberately. How could this have happened? Next to the keypad diagram, there's a sticky note with a number. Okay. Okay. Anything through the picture? Flyer. How's the airbrush look? Optional electromagnetic fail safe feature. Reactivate with less power. Read the note. Read the note. Method your company to do the illustration. Have them set the password to specify on the form. Lock the schematic plus the combination on the cellar cage when done. Oh, so your combination to the door is in the cellar. Yeah. Don't let them enter the attic. Thank you. Why are you suddenly so obsessed with security? I can't tell if you're working. Keep something out or something in. Why would they even want to go in the attic? Right away, very bad things can happen to you. Don't if you see it. something that makes you feel funny, tell an adult. <laughs> no. There's something on the wall in there, too. Yeah. I guess that means it's important. You have a lot of noise downstairs. It's my feet. Is it? Yeah. Oh wow. You make a lot of noise. Yep. What's uh what's that page again? This one? Um it's a manuscript of some sort. Oh. Holy lightning strikes thrice. You're baptized in the great gunshot of it, the halo your skull makes against the night. Swallowing dark, what moves beneath your flesh, greet the worms in your lungs, 
I am where you are here, where I was before. <laughs> Discard the husk. Yeah, this is written by that guy we saw in that dream. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't a dream. It, it was a Tuesday. It was a Tuesday in my dream. Okay. Welcome to power outage. Yep, I'm like, yeah, the power's out. Text is about something called the Watcher. Where is the book that this is missing from? Um, the Watcher. Master Tim, you're gonna be murdered soon. I think it's, it's actually paused. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Watcher. Can you close the door? <laughs> right. Oh, I think I saw Watcher. Happy and beloved as I have been. Ah. Why are you guys wandering around? Because the power's out. Here, hey, what's up? I don't like this. Let's try and figure this out, okay? I need the manuscript. Nope. Alright, so we check Dracula. Already. Okay. Wonder if there's another book around here somewhere. There is. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, you know what's in this. It's gotta be. Yeah, it seemed very religious, huh? Yeah, something called the Watcher, and it's like really weird. Next page. Can you go into your notes and stuff and read the page? Uh, it's a notebook. So I don't think so. I'll... Somebody was taking notes from yeah. the page, and or they wrote one ten. Or that's just a number combination for one of the three-digit locks that we've come across. Do 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 do. Meh. Have you changed? No, you're intact. Okay.
be a really thick newspaper. Hmm? That'd be a really thick newspaper, page 110. Yeah. Person walking by. You the baddie? You guys all dead yet? No, you're just standing there, staring blankly into the distance. Okay. Am I downstairs? Can I watch you get stabbed? Like, I would love that, actually. Because you are, you have like the personality of a doorknob. Tim. <laughs> I want to see if he says it again. Or something different. Like... He like, you bother him enough, and he finally admits that he's going through this shit, too. He's been here for years. Yeah. Two are dead. Oh yeah, he's upstairs uh, putting on your friend's skin. Why is it always putting on skin? Why can't they just like... I don't know. Oh. Killers aren't uh, comfortable in their own skin a lot of times. Will they take that of others? I guess. There we go. There we go. Now what do the color bars mean? One, three, three, oh. two. Yeah, where did we see those before? Downstairs. Later, nerds. Uh, <laughs> I hope you like being stabbed. Bye. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. I was thinking he was going to be, like, right there. Like, as soon as you turn the corner to the basement, like, stab. Yeah. Check in the iron door. Uh, start. It's what? One. God. It's fine, you just have to get the bottom one right first. And work your way up. Or is he coming? I heard the knife thing go off. So one of them is dead. At least one of them is dead. There was the other one. They're both dead now. Thing so is, like, I what can't. What was the combination? Uh, should be this one. Two, three, three, one. Yeah. Uh, so let's start at the bottom. I can't. Well, two is right. 
Go to the third one. There we go. Okay then. Two seven eight. To get into the cellar. The note. <laughs> Ray <Right> on <laughs> the silent killer. Is that what this is? It's all just hallucination. Um. Radon does not make you hallucinate. It just kills you. <laughs> I thought this that's what this said. Or did I read it wrong? Radon! Oh. Don't remember deadly things like wheezing. Make sure your family is safe. Use a radon test. Oh, I forgot what the combination was. 278. Was it really? Hmm? Isn't that? Alright, too bad. Nope. Must be nope. going upstairs then, huh? Yeah, there's a keypad right at the top of the stairs. Did he come around the corner? He doesn't. He just follows your head. You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of, um, I think it's called Clock Tower. Um, and the premise of it is like you're, you're basically doing what we're doing now, but the guy's following you around with a pair of like garden shears. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and all you hear is like the sound of him opening and closing them. Oh, jeez. And it's like, holy shit. You died in the hallway. You were stabbed to death. I don't remember where the other fucking cabinet was. We need to hide in. It definitely wasn't in here. Now we go into the kitchen. That's the last place I remember. <laughs> Step over my friend's corpses. <laughs> hey! <laughs> So, what was your new memory? Oh yeah, I guess we could do that while we're in here, right? That it worked? For the cellar lock? So, cellar's unlocked. That's that door at the end of the hall, downstairs? That would be the cellar, wouldn't it? I don't know. Um, maybe the keypad, the, the 278. Gave power? To the cellar door downstairs? Maybe. I don't know, let's go check. Oh shit, he was right there. <laughs> Did he just jump out of the wall? No, he was like standing there. Was he? Perfectly still. Yeah, I saw him. I did not. He looked like the wall to me. Oh man. Oh, he got you good, bitch. Whoa. Who are you? And why do I? Oh, it's Pete. Oh, hi, Pete. Hey, we actually get to learn something about you. Are you the killer? Uh. I mean, you're thinking I mean, he's you're I, thinking he's dead, right? Well, I did until he started talking to us. Let's let's go with your original hunch and say he's dead. Don't be too sad about me. I wasn't sad about you in the first place. <laughs> no, you're a potato flake, man. 
And it's just a few buttons that determine whether or not some kind of auxiliary power gets directed to the power box in the living room. I don't want to set it to on. Okay. See you again soon, like the next time I get fucking stabbed. Yeah, so now we can get in the basement, like, super quick. Alright, see you, nerd. I'm out of here. 278. Any murderers down here? Okay. You just have to set it on. The light with the minesweeper thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that panel. Can you check the minesweeper picture again? Not, not the post-it note. The one in your memory. Fuck's sake, Tim. Which one is Oh, there it is. Yeah, it's a 4x4 four four grid, just like the lights in front of you. So put in where the three mines are. Good catch. Oh, nice. 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 You want to set it to on. Power is set to on. And that determines that the box upstairs gets power. So uh, the door, does it open? I guess the door is open. Nope. Oh, wait a second. It just says the blue cable now has power. Ah. Oh, okay, shit. so you can reroute power positive to positive, negative to negative. So if I do this, what does it do? Oh, it just switches things, okay. Is it like there's two options per level? See, it kind of seems that way. Yeah. So the power to go left is from the bottom the top. But I bet I could get both, huh? Get both? What yeah. do you mean get both? Get them on both sides. I want you to go down. Yeah, my guess is that's what you want to do, because, like, 
the thing upstairs didn't work either. The thing upstairs, oh, the three by three grid, that's right. One back. Now two back. Go. Now the negative and positive are separated. Shit. around the corner on the left. Right. What do you mean negative and positive can't go together? It's gonna make an explosion. Would burn the house down by fucking now. Right. Holy shit. Holy shit, did you just get it? So Sweet. <laughs> what was what the, the like, fuck? What achievement was that? <laughs> well, I mean, eh? oh, you're that guy at the gas station. I was really hoping that we could waste more time what? talking to you. <laughs> Hello, Emily. <laughs> it is Emily, right? Do you know who I am? My name is Parker Nest. I don't care. Parker Nest, I ba barely know her. Is not Rom still Rom? What? <laughs> Please make sense. Yeah. Tell me what that creature, the homunculus, when it attacks you, do you feel it? Do you feel anything when you die? Uh, learning to ignore it, maybe? <laughs> Would you? What's that? I mean, if somebody's killing you with a knife, could you ignore it? <laughs> What the hell can I, well, I mean, it's better than the alternative. What the hell kind of question is that? I, that's uh, more along the lines of what I think, but... Mm, go for it. Not what your friend said. Find to whom this cruel world appears, and you will know why it appears so cruel. In the attic, you'll find a device I've built, something that... Uh, the pissed off chamber... Mac what are all these words? Right? Oh. 
Okay. All right. Naturally, it didn't. Goodbye, Emily. What? Dude, what? He built something that just made the house and made the monster and made all my friends and me. Well, it's <clears throat> like he was talking about how it was like remaking us, basically. Yeah. That's why you keep coming back, allegedly. Yeah. Fucking shit. Okay. Don't encourage him. Okay. I, I I feel you. I do. I'm on your side. Also, you need to stop doing this puzzle. <laughs> stop. <laughs> but, father... <laughs> Another hour gone. <laughs> Question is, how do I get that's a oh, little spotlight? Ah, so we'll redirect the power away from the door because the door does nothing for me. That's like kill me. <laughs> Yeah, escape the house again. A lot of good that's gonna fucking do me. Right. Hello. Hello. needed to go right. So when you did the puzzle last time, do you think you got one or the other? I got the ones leading to the left. Oh. Three weeks later. Yeah, the bad part is this, like, I can't tell if there's like a rhyme or reason for any of this you know what i mean you can't no it's like i guess to a certain extent that i can it's just like it's just difficult <laughs> like i don't know how else to explain it, it just kind of like this whole thing kind of sucks okay so that leads there Okay, now that, okay. 
Now I just need to connect. Oh man, I have the negative connected and that's the hard one. <laughs> It's not the bottom level. Don't touch the bottom level anymore. Before you go get murdered. Okay. No, I was, I was just trying to remember. <laughs> <laughs> For the next time that I have to inevitably do that. I should have taken screenshots. <laughs> and, yeah, I mean, seeing the finished solution, like, I don't know, at least for me, wouldn't help. That's why it didn't work. There you go. One, two, three, four. I wish you would just install a normal lock. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I had to. Ugh. Is that me, Sal? I can't believe they gave you an achievement for that. Yep. Alright, this has been Homebody. I don't want to back down, but he does, but I don't want to. And then I tried to convince him that I didn't, and I wanted to, though, but he didn't. I don't know. And then we stared at dudes. Hey. <laughs> That was the wrong choice. No, are are you are you together now, and you're going to the house together? I guess we're going to some sort of bar outside of town, maybe. Friday the 13th. Clef, like, dude, like, bro, who hurt you? <laughs> yeah, like, homeboy, are you okay? Like...
He's just talking about like a work site? I don't know, I can't read that fast. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I clicked it too fast. That's a sad little story. I you know what happened in Signs? In Signs? The like movie. The movie? I know the movie Signs. There's that thing from Signs. That happened in Signs? I don't remember it happening in Signs. I should bring that to my coworker. Dude's like a walking IMDb. The M. Night Shyamalan movie Signs. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Turns out she's pinned against the truck. Oh, yeah. The truck and pin, having her pinned against the tree is keeping her alive, keeping all the organs inside. Yep. So Are you on the wrong side of the road, dude? So he's worried that this is going to happen to him. Yeah, he's having like an existential crisis. Yeah. I've seen you die so many times. Tam. <laughs> I obviously chose wrong, man. I mentioned it. I'm sorry, too. Are you? You almost got us killed anyway. Where are we? Yeah, Cliff, you're a little unhinged. How long have we been driving? Yeah, a little unhinged. I don't think covers it. I was being polite. All right, you want you want to do another one? Yeah, we could we could break for lunch. Uh, yeah, this one. <laughs> the first episode <laughs> we broke after like a half hour. This one went ninety minutes. What uh? Like I don't have to tell you. <laughs> yeah, we can, we break just, twice. We just got into it. All we right, could, we can we'll break. Be back. More yeah. spinning. Break for two lunges. Every time you do that, the mouse resets, so I can't. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm done. I'm done.